Estero Llano Grande State Park. It's a world birding center and it's one of the nine proposed and existing sites. It's a birding paradise located in deep south Texas, just south of the city of Westlaco in the historic Rio Grande Valley. This 200 acre plus recreated wetlands and scrub thorn forest was in cooperation with the Texas Parks and Wildlife, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Services, and the city of Westlaco, along with the help of Ducks Unlimited, and the restoration of a wetlands that mirrors the native habitat of what this area would have been like possibly 200 years ago before all the dams were placed on the Rio Grande. Much of the area's natural and native habitat was lost as the development of agriculture took hold along the fertile fields near the second longest river in the United States, that being the Rio Grande. The diversity of native plants and animals decreased as the population and the development increased. Now, however, with more awareness that we must coexist with nature, Estero Yana Canandi State Park was born. Under the direction of Martha Martinez Garcia, our park manager, it is now a dream in progress. The lakes and the marshes that attract waterfowl from wading egrets and herons to least sandpipers, from roseate spoonbills to the many species of ducks. Here at Estero Yana Grande State Park, bird watching is at its best. Rarities from Mexico and Central America occasionally wander up for a visit, as did the northern Jacana in the fall of 2006. Attracting birds from all over the United States and Canada, bringing in many ecotourism dollars, which encourages the local governments to extend and expand more native habitat. The park, a former agricultural field, also boasts approximately three miles of trails winding through the wetlands on a raised boardwalk. It has easily accessible trails through the subtropical scrub thorn forest where mammals such as coyotes, bobcats, possums, armadillos, and it also has the endangered Texas tortoise, as well as many different reptiles. They can all be seen here. The diversity of the landscape be it along the banks of the Arroyo Catarata, which is on our southern boundary, uh, the reconstructed <laughs> wetlands to the mesquite and cactus forest. Adventure awaits. A pair of large alligators at Alligator Lake will bring excitement to children and to adults alike. Opportunity to learn about our native environment is an enjoyable and rewarding experience that will be recalled to memory many, many times from native plants, of which insects and butterflies must have for their survival, to the wetlands that gives its bounty to the waterfowl. We have it all. Also located near the entrance is a visitor center, where one can observe many species of birds from its covered deck overlooking one of the lakes. Picnic tables are provided here for those that would like to bring a pack to lunch. Also, a well-stocked store to purchase much-needed items that help you to learn and enjoy the nature that you may encounter while exploring the habitat of the lower Rio Grande Valley. Available, too, is a large meeting room. It's open for school groups, seminars, and the general public. On-site are personnel to assist you to make the most of your visit. Come and enjoy our nature. It's here at Estero Yannick State Park.